Colonel Major Nana Sangare, an officer in the Malian Army, is a trainee at the end of her training at the G5 Sahel Defense College in Rockchurch, Mauritania. The Defense College here is for military elites and brings them together for two levels of higher military education at the staff school and the war school. For Colonel Major Nana Sangare, military women should not be left out of the process of fighting against terrorism in the Sahelian zone. We Against terrorism and jihadism, women have a lot to contribute. It's easier for women to have contact within the population, and it's the population that is really terrorized. Women can openly talk about their problems to women. It's even easier that way. So when there is a woman who is leading the investigations in relation to anything, they can go far. They can say everything and anything. The G5 Sahel Defense College was first a Mauritanian project created in 2013, well before the birth of the G5 Sahel. Originally, the institution was intended to raise the level and capabilities of the Mauritanian army in the face of the new security threats. The college has a simulation center capable of putting the trainee in a field situation. The G5 Sahel reposes on two pillars. The G5 Sahel is based on two pillars, a development pillar and a defense and security pillar. The armies of the G5 countries being confronted with the same threat. It was imperative that the executives who command the forces on the ground underwent the same training to understand the same vision of the threat and the same methodological approach and the same work processes, because at the end of the day, they find themselves in the same theater, working to face the same enemy. In three years of operation, 106 officers have been trained here, some of whom are deployed within the G5 Sahel Joint Force. From now on, the school will be open to officers who are not only from the G5 Sahel. Cameroon has asked to send soldiers here. For this third level of promotion, 44 training officers received their diplomas from the hands of the Chadian Minister of Defense, who reminded them that from now on, it is up to the Sahelians to solve the problems of the Sahel and not to foreigners. That's a typical approach, especially in the area of the environment, and that is what we need to focus on. And I hope that after this training that we've received here, that will be effective enough on the ground to fight terrorism. The G5 Sahel War College is the first transnational institution to offer training in techniques and the operability in the Sahel zone to military officers. The message is now clear for the leaders of this institution. It is up to the Sahelians to find the answer to the Sahel problem, to fight terrorists, and jihadist. It is no longer enough to wage the war alone, but from now on the population must also be involved in the process. Depuis Noachok pour Africa News Television, je suis Joël Honoré Kwam.